Ever wonder how you'd die? There are so many ways to choose from. Accident, heroic death, or just letting nature take its course. Or maybe mosquito bite. Wait, what? That's so lame. But in reality, it's actually scarier than it seems. Seen these killer animals on TV? Forget them. They're amateurs compared to the real professional killer here. 80s mosquito. They're so good at their job, their kills are countless. And they're not dropping anytime soon. Now, what can be so scary about this teeny weeny little insect? For one, it's actually larger than your average mosquitoes, with better fashion sense. And they lived by the vampire diet. Athletes, children, pregnant women, even your pets are not safe. Once they decide that they like the taste of you, it's time to unleash their six hidden needles. Yes, you heard that right. The needles work as a six-in-one weapon and mercilessly saw through our tissues and greedily suck the life force out of us. After their buffet, they'll thank you for the wonderful meal by leaving a tip. We call the tip dengue. It's a virus that destroys our immune system until we drop dead. Victims would experience typical flu symptoms, high fevers, headaches, blood vomiting, organ failure, and even death. As a virus, dengue fever has no cure. The most effective way is to prevent 80s mosquito bites to begin with. We have invented mosquito nets, insect repellents, destroy their breeding grounds, insecticide spraying, and so on for protection. As of recently, a new countermeasure is brought into the program. Say hello to Mosquito Magnet. Mosquito Magnet is a device that, by using gasoline power, releases CO2 gases and heat that is very similar to humans, thus attracting mosquitoes up to one kilometer away. And when they get close enough, boom, they get sucked into a cage where they will dehydrate to their death. According to previous experiments, within four weeks, out of just five schools in Cebu, a whopping 145,200 mosquitoes have been captured. 26% of which are these 80s mosquitoes that have been killing us. This is a rather excellent start, as the environment would be safer with the decreased risk of dengue. Surely, even more lives can be saved too. Time to get rid of these buggers once and for all.